Hello everybody, it's Cobbler's Vlogs and there's been some exciting news in the last 24 hours and as you can see by the title, Dean Austin has been sacked and more importantly, Keith Curl has been appointed the new manager of Northampton Town and we're going to go through my reaction, so let's get into it. Now at the time I'm recording this on Monday uh, the 1st of October at 10 past 4 in the afternoon I was actually going to just record my reaction to Dean Austin getting sacked but obviously we've got Curl as the manager now so that will add a little bit onto the, the end of the video but first of all I want to talk about Dean Austin. Um, now I was quite glad that he was sacked to be honest, I didn't think he was the right man for the job from day one. Um, those of you that know me will know that, I didn't want him in from, the, from, from day one, I wanted somebody experienced that could keep us up in League One. Um, so yeah, it was a gamble to bring in Dean Austin, a gamble that didn't really pay off because obviously we went down in the end um, and obviously the first 10 games this season haven't been good enough. I wasn't at Mansfield on Saturday but from the goals that I've seen that were conceded, um, not good. Um, again, the concern, the, st the good thing at the start of the season was that we were playing well but we weren't scoring goals and creating ch taking chances but this season we're not doing either of them, we're not, we're not playing, right now as in we're not playing we're not playing well, we're not creating chances and we're losing games. Um, to be fair, I think the players have lost Dean Austin his job. I think he had all the passion um, to, to, to do the job and keep us, well, <laughs> get us up to the top of the table. Not even keep us in League Two, but get us to the top of League Two. I think he had the passion to do that, um, but obviously that never came off. Uh, so the, the, that never really worked um, with the players. Um, so that's essentially what's got him sacked. The results uh, is, is what's lost him his job in the end. Um, again, I'm quite glad he's gone, to be fair. I think the, the, a lot of mixed reactions. Some people are devastated. Some people um, thought that he'd, he'd pull it back. Um, I didn't, didn't see that happening, I'll be honest. Um, so I'm quite relieved that he's, that he's now finally, we finally got rid of him. Um, well, I'll say finally, but he, he wasn't, he, he wasn't given a... Wasn't given very long at the club, was he? Um, but ten games in, at the start of the season without a squad, he should be doing a lot better than twenty-first in the table. So, yeah, some people are devastated, some people are delighted, uh, as, as I am, um, that, that he's gone. Wish him all the best for the future. He had all the passion for the club, but the players weren't playing for them, for him. I think the players have, have lost him his job, um, but I didn't really want him in from day one. So it, it's, it, I mean, it's good, good to see him go. To be honest. Um, let me know what you thought on the sacking uh, down in the comments section below. I'll read all your comments um, and, and yeah, just let me know your opinion. Now that they've got rid of Dean Austin, uh, the club have done what I wanted them to do when they sacked Jimmy Floyd House Rank. Bring somebody in that's got experience, that knows the league and that essentially can get us back up into League One because let's face it, after House Bank was sacked, it was too late to keep us up in League Two. Uh, in League One, sorry. Um, we needed someone that was experienced, that would take us... Uh, that. I think we need to bear in mind the fact that we we're going to get relegated into League Two um, on when we sacked Hasselbank, and that's probably why we brought in Dean Austin. Uh, a bit of a gamble, um, in my eyes, it was it was a massive gamble that obviously hasn't paid off. In terms of Curl, um, experienced manager, uh, he knows he knows League Two. He's managed over four hundred games in the league. Um, in his first ever season, he got Mansfield to the League Two playoff final. Um, he's been at big clubs such as Crystal Palace, QPR. Uh, Notts County as well. Um, he got them to just outside the playoffs, and with Notts County, he went 22 away games unbeaten. Um, in Carlisle, he did well with them as well. Uh, finished tenth with them. Uh, he got to the fourth round of the FA Cup and the third round of uh, the League Cup or the Carabao Cup, um, as you may know it. Uh, he's going to be at the Cobblers until the end of next season. So he's got this season and the end of next season, and then obviously we'll give him an extension. Um, so if if he deserves one, um, again we've got an experienced manager who knows knows the league well, um, and it's what we need to it's what we need what we needed to be honest. His teams are hard to beat. Usually they're usually well organised, well set up, um, and, and it's what we needed. Someone with experience that knows league two who can now get us to go like this up the table towards the top and hopefully challenge Oldham. Um, for the title and maybe that last day of the season could come down to, to the title but who knows let's not get carried away um, it could go completely wrong it could go well for five or six games and then just fade off again and, and, and we'll all get on his back um, but I think now playoffs is probably realistic uh, maybe maybe third and you know, automatic but uh, he's got a big job on his hands um, and he's got a long while into the transfer window as well a good two or three months um, until the transfer window starts so he's going to have to wait before we can do what, what he wants with the squad um, in the transfer window, but it's pos it's looking positive. We've got a good, experienced manager that knows the league in Keith Curl, 
and uh, hopefully he can get us back up as high as high up in the table as possible. So yeah, just a really quick video today, guys, um, about my reaction to Dean Austin's sacking, which I'm quite happy with, um, and then again the appointment, even happier with that Keith Curl. So yeah, uh, drop a like on the video if you have enjoyed it. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Subscribe to all our partners in the description below. And make sure uh, you let me know your thoughts on the Dean Austin sacking and the Keith Curl appointment. And until Wednesday when our Berry Home vlog comes out, we'll see you later. Bye-bye.